Welcome back to another season of NWO News on Alpha Point Five Top Five. And before we get into today's segment, I just wanted to say in the summer, we're feeling real summer inspired, by the way. In the summer right now, we got a lot of things going on. The WNBA coverage, recaps from the big chance. Might pull up the zone six with the guys and interview the players or something. Who knows? Um, I just want to say thank y'all for your continuous viewership for the program. And let's get into this new segment. Welcome to Live from 0.5 and NWO Sports, live from West 4th, the cage. A lot of crossovers were made here in this park. And with that being said, I'm going to give you all my top five crossovers by our NBA players. For number five is a two-way tie between James Harden, The Bid, and Steph Curry. Um, I, di I didn't know who to pick in this situation. God forbid you playing the pickup game against these two and you get ISO to switch. Be prepared to dance. I'm talking Michael Renner, gets 30, everything. Now, back when I was a young buck, there was this guy that played. And I don't think he played for the next of the Dallas Mavericks. I'm talking the senior one, Tim Hardaway. Man, the killer crossover. He invented that. That was him, Tim. Crawford. You talk about a dancer. This nigga was a soul trained dancer. <laughs> he was a he was an eleven color dancer. God forbid you had to guard him. Huh? I know the bone collector is, is is taken by the street baller, but this AI nickname for real. I'm talking Antonio Daniels, Tyrone Loon, MJ. The man crossover changed the dribbling rules for Christ's sake. We said, thank God, Allen Iverson wasn't 6'6". Six, six. That that applies to Kyrie Irving, too. It would be Elva. The man Uncle Drew. Want to talk about <laughs> both hands. Ambidextric, his middle name. Rap and basketball go hand in hand. It's kind of like when you... You hear somebody rap and they say this person is their favorite rapper. That's what you see if you ever saw a Ryan Strickland play to his godfather, Kyrie Irving. It's like the same thing. Before we get out of here, I just wanted to say tonight, the season they view of NWO News, a big moment. Similar to that moment, like when John was coming back off a hiatus and he faxed the Bulls, we're back. But similar to when Amigos tweeted, we're back. And let us know after a long hiatus, they was going to come back and do coach three. So... In the words of the two greats, we're back. <laughs> Tune in next Tuesday for more NWO news and live for Point Five's top five. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Have a good night. Turn up like a corpse in the Hudson. Turning blunts in the porch like bunting.